kind of the start to the third quarter honcho a little bit? Yeah, I really thought we had a, a great crowd today. I thought the, you know, it was a, it was a pretty neat experience because we had a lot of people in the stands today to come out and watch some really good basketball from two really good teams and. It was a fun game to be a part of, you know, and, it, it, and uh, I'm really proud of our team because I thought we battled really hard in this game, and we were never out of it. We, we did play poorly in the third quarter, but, but uh, we sort of found a way to dig out of that hole. And again, I say this every press conference. I don't know why any of us would be surprised. We've done that all year. We get down, but we, we don't get out. And um, I've just been really, really impressed with our team. I think uh, one of the things that, that beat us down the stretch is we were, we were daring one of their players to shoot the ball all night long, and she finally did, and doggone it if she didn't make it. So uh, uh, hats off to her. Uh, she, I think she's as responsible for that win as anything else. So good for her. I think uh, Brooke does a really good job at La Tech. Um, she's really done a great job with the, with the players that she has, and uh, she's a great coach, great recruiter. So uh, La Tech isn't going anywhere soon, so we're going to have to make sure that uh, we, we figure out a way to keep up. What was kind of the, the process there in the last 13 seconds? What were you kind of looking for? Well. I, um, we, we had a really nice little set play. We were going to run off the inbounds, and um, she was kind of open off the stagger, and she was, you know, not open enough for her to shoot it. So then she was supposed to drive to the heavy side of the floor and kick yeah. it. Uh, I think it was Roe, but I'd have to look back. Um, uh, and she just did. She went the wrong way. She went right instead of left. Imagine that a kid going right instead of left. <laughs> Imagine that. So we probably should have set her up a little bit better so she could use her right hand. And uh, um, we didn't quite get that. Ball goes out of bounds, baseline out of bounds, and we had a neat little uh, handoff play we were going to run. But Cat decided to run her own little play there at the end, and uh, we didn't get what we wanted. So um, you know, it's one of those things. We have really good kids. They do what they want to do sometimes, but she's trying to win. She's trying to be successful. She's trying to make a play. So. Uh, uh, I'm never going to uh, criticize her for that. Coach Naj had no points today. Um, was she, how was her demeanor on the court? What, what was she battling with, or did she just have a rough game? I think she's had a rough game. I, it started for her. It, it started for her in the unnoticeables. The unnoticeables were for most for the layman fan who just you know shows up. She wasn't guarding, you know. And if you don't defend, then then you, we can't have you on the floor. And uh, she wasn't guarding the way she's capable of guarding. So we had to get her off the floor. I hate it for her that she didn't play well. Um, she, she works hard every day in practice. She deserves uh, success, but today wasn't her day. And I hope that uh, she learns from this, grows from this, and uh, we get better from it in our next game. You did a great job keeping them off the boards until the last two seconds of the first half, and it seemed to kind of snowball the world. Yeah, you know, they, were, uh, they are an extremely tough offensive rebounding team. I mean, they're plus four in the rebounding category every time they play. Uh, we knew that. Um, they're just a hard team to keep off the boards. Um, uh, she was on the back there at the, at the end of the first half. Uh, it was a really nice block out. We didn't get rewarded for that. But, you know, it was one of those things where we, we, they out-rebounded us, I think, by nine and a third. I think that probably hurt us more than anything else. Five on, on offensive, too. Was, yeah, was five offensive. Offensive. I think it's what it was, yeah. I think it really hurt us because we're getting the stops that we want and then not getting the rebound, so it affects our energy. Uh, 500 in conference. Uh, I believe seven or eight games left in the season. You go from here. Well, I'm really excited about um, uh, the future of our team this season because um, I just told uh, Tamara in the, in the locker room, if you'll play like that the rest of the year, we won't lose a game. And it's the same thing with Sousa. If she'll get 13 points and six rebounds for the rest of the year, we may not lose another one. So uh, I'm excited about our team. I, I think we, we played well enough to win today. We really did. And if you'd have told me that this morning, that we were going to play well enough to win, I would have taken it. We just didn't. And, um, you know, if I could go back and erase two minutes from the third quarter, I would. But that's not how the game works. You got to play 40 minutes, and um, La Tech did. Thanks, guys. Thank you, Coach. Mm -hmm.